Now, the Minister for Roads and Highways, Kwesi Amwakwacha, has charged contractors on the three tier of Takwa the PTC interchange to fully utilize working at night to make up for the lost construction time as his ministry will not extend the agreed project construction schedule. Kwesi Amakwata gave a caution during his tour of the Takradi Kwame Nkrumah roundabout interchange project after the consultant of the project told him of some delays due to rainfall. City News' Western Regional Correspondent, Kwesi J. Nim has won. The Takradi Kwame Nkrumah roundabout third tier interchange, also referred to as PTC roundabout, is one of six interchanges being constructed under the Ghana Sino Hydro deal. This three-tier interchange upon completion is expected to ensure direct easy access to the central business district of Takrade from Takwa and Cape Coast and vice versa. Although the shortcutting for the three-tier PTC runabout interchange took place in September 2020 to be completed within 30 months, actual works began 10 months after the shortcutting. To appreciate the pace of construction, the Roads and Highways Minister, Kwesi Amwakwata, Today, inspected the installation of piles and construction of concrete works for main pillars of the interchange. Briefing the minister, the resident engineer, Joshua Alote, said, although they are making progress, they have some lost time due to rainfall. The, the, the shortfall was due to a lot of rain. You know, we started in July. So the rain and then the piling, the pile work is in the ground. And that was always filled by rainwater and rain, so and that is what caused the little delay. The roads and highways minister, in a response, challenged the contractors to fully utilize night work to address the lost time since any delays would affect other projects, including the planned power grant runabout interchange, which he also visited. Government will not grant any extension of time, okay, because of the cost implication to it. So please make for the time lost with the uh, night work program that you have introduced. I'm happy about it. Government is happy about it. And let it be part and parcel of this project. Because this project must be delivered in record time, you, okay? You know, you know because if this project is delayed, okay, even by one day, by one week, by one month, is affecting the commencement of the park grant interchange. The resident engineer who says 18% of work has already been done also assured the completion of the project within schedule. And you are supposed to complete on 23rd, sorry, um, middle of uh, July 2023. We are very optimistic that we can finish before time because we've done so much work within a short time and um, by, let's say, October we are around 12% and now we've done about 18%. Speaking earlier during a courtesy call to his office, the Western Regional Minister pleaded with the Rose Minister to terminate dragging road contracts in the region. As it's becoming too much of a burden on us in the region. When radio station day in day out keep complaining about rules that have been awarded, but work is not going on. So I'm very happy that, for instance, the road from Apawai to Impoho, when I wrote you the recommendation to terminate, you immediately need it. The overall anticipation for this project is that it will come to actually address the issue of traffic when entering the central business district of Sekendi Takrade Metropolis. For City News, I'm Akwesi Jenim. Talk about it.